Good morning, church family. It is good to, to see you guys again, or at least to be seen by you again. I, uh, I want to f- first start off saying uh, thank you for all those that, that got on uh, last week, that uh, viewed the, the message, viewed the service last week. Uh, we had over 70 views, uh, which is great, and uh, that just tells me there's probably um, do- at least double that as many people that, that viewed it. So uh, that's, that's great. It's been a great, uh, it was great for me and my family uh, to to be able to watch the service at home and have communion together and even have Andrew and Jeremy, they served us communion, they brought the communion to us, uh, which is cool. And uh, I, I like to see, uh, I love seeing how many how many families got together as well that normally don't, maybe don't sit next to each other in church, but they view the service together and they, they worship together. So that, that was just great. And also that those that have shared the service with others uh, who don't have a service of their own to watch a virtual service or to, to, to partake in, uh, so that is just really encouraging for us, and we really pray that, that we can not just bless our own church family here, uh, but it be a blessing to others, uh, that those uh, can join uh, and worship together. So, especially in a time of need as we're going through right now. Uh, so really thank you guys, especially those that have chosen to love one another, and, and really didn't look at it as a, as a problem, but as an opportunity uh, to love each other. And, and we remember Jesus said, uh, that they will know us and know that Jesus was sent to be the Messiah by the way we love one another. So that is uh, great, and thank you guys for responding uh, in, in such a great way. Next week is Palm Sunday, as many of you know, and uh, so not too much different here. The message will be different. Uh, it'll be a Palm Sunday message, uh, so we'll get out of the book of Ephesians next week, and then it'll be Easter Sunday. Uh, it might be a little bit different. Uh, we're praying that next uh, the next two weeks, we can get back together for Easter Sunday, uh, but if that doesn't happen, we will still have service and Jesus is still risen. Amen. Uh, one announcement I would like to mention as far as for those that are viewing online and are at least trying to view online, there, there's just been one difficulty, uh, one little challenge is that some people didn't have their autoplay on uh, for YouTube, and so you got to make sure your autoplay is on, otherwise you would have to click on each video um, rather than just let it play and then also your shuffle needs to be off so autoplay on shuffle off and that'll make things a lot easier for you well I think that's it so uh, if you could please join your hearts with mine as we pray God we thank you for this great opportunity that we get again not maybe not join together physically uh, together but in spirit and uh, God, we thank you that you are God who unites us. We are united in Christ, as we're going to speak about today. We thank you that uh, through the blood of Jesus uh, on the cross that you have united us as one. And no matter where we are, as your church. And so on this day, and your day, God, we get to come together as your church, as your people, unified in spirit and unified uh, as your body. We thank you for this time. Help us to be reminded of whose we are. And, and how about how to be reminded of uh, that you are the God who holds us in his hand. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen.